Today I'm going to show you a quick core superset that you can do, add to the end of the workout to really build your core strength. Hey, what's going on? My name is Hunter from Hybrid Fitness Systems. Now in this video, I'm going to show you two different exercises that you can combine together to make a superset. Now the first exercise, uh, you know, I have a back extension machine here, but you don't need one all the time. You could uh, replace this for Superman's, which I'll, uh, I'll link a video right here um, for Superman. But the first exercise, back extension, what I want you to do is you do about 15 to 20 reps total of these. You start at a neutral position, just like you'd be standing up your back, you want that in the same position. I normally like to cross my hands in front. Now you can, if this gets too easy, you can eventually add like a plate of weight and put it here to increase the resistance for this video. I'm up. So you can go down, you want to release and go to complete flexion and then come back up. And now this is really important. Um, you want to make sure you don't hyper extend your back. So if you come up too far, you're going to put too much tension on your back. A lot of people hurt their back that way, depending on, uh, I mean, people have different degrees of back pain. Um, and sensitive. Some people just have like their trouble back there. So be careful. Figure out what's right for you. But I would say don't hyperextend too much. I personally like to go right here, neutral in the spine, and then back down. And do 15 to 20 of those. Immediately after you complete those reps, you're gonna come down, and this is gonna be an upper ab exercise. And it's just a simple crunch, but I added my own flavor to it, so if you want to come a little bit closer here. What you're going to do is you're going to lay down on your back. You bring, bring it up, bring it up. And uh, so lay down on your back. You can plant your knees, have your heels on the ground. And what I want you to do is, almost like you're getting set up for a bench press, roll your shoulders back, get a little curve in your back. And then, literally you're just crunching the short distance with your upper abs, you're not coming forward, you're picking a spot on the ceiling and trying to touch it with your hands right here. So the, the key is when you come down, you want to push your back upwards and that's going to create a little bit more range of motion and work your abs a little bit more. After about 15 to 20 reps, which is what I want you to do, you'll feel it in these upper abs. So you combine those two exercises, no rest in between, do those for two to three sets, at the end of your workout or during your ab day, and that's gonna really help strengthen your core. So hey, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I've got more videos coming for you soon. So again, I appreciate you watching and have a good one.